We salute to the flag. Everybody rise, please. Salute. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Like I'm the current president of Farm the Open Network. I'm going to turn the program over now to our MC, <laughs> Lieutenant Lynch, Tom Lynch, and he's going to carry on things from here. All right, uh, I'm not much MC, but I'll do my best. Um, there's a brief letter from my brother. This is how it all got started. My brother's in the Air Force, and uh, just a series of events, you know, uh, uh, little steps from a lot of people brought it all together. Uh, so he wrote, Back in September 2009, after arriving in Afghanistan, I remembered something my brother Tom showed me. In July 2006, uh, while attending a family funeral, I was able to visit the Palmdale Fire Department with my brother and his wife Jennifer, both members of the fire department. I saw a memorial wall for Chief Gansey, and at the time, other than his position in the FDNY, NYFD, I knew, that I knew his name from somewhere in my military life. I returned to England, where I was living at the time, and did some research and found where I knew his name from. A military base in Iraq was named after, after Chief Gamson. Although at the time, the base had been turned over to the Iraqi forces, and the name relocated to Manus Air Force Base in Kyrgyzstan. Uh, just a quick uh, uh, note on that, they, uh, they stopped naming bases after people or heroes, because they uh, become targets then. So the base, uh, t the guys call it Chief Gans uh, Camp Gansey, but it's Manus Air Force Base uh, in Kyrgyzstan, north of Afghanistan. I remember the wall and did not, and it did not include a flag from the base. That is, that is where this, this started. I contacted the Chief Master Sergeant James Dowell, Commanding Chief for the 376E AEW, Air Expeditionary Wing, and made a request. I explained who I was and the reason I was contacting him. I requested that a flag be flown over Manus Air Force Base, officially, unofficially Gansey Air Force Base, for inclusion of the memorial wall of, of Chief Gansey. At the time, with everything that I knew what was going on in that part of the world, I really didn't expect a response. Chief Dowell surprised me. I received a response back within a couple of days with the answer that would be an honor to he would be honored to assist with the honoring of Chief Gansey. The chief said that they wanted to do something special in Chief Gansey's memory. From everything I have read on what they did, they surpassed any expectation I had. Since this started on several occasions, I've been referred to as the guy who made it happen. This is incorrect. The only thing I did was make requests to, uh, to some very busy people, employed men and women of U.S. Air Force took the time out to make this happen. The ceremony at the FFD is accumulation of their efforts. While I might have been the catalyst, it was Manus that made it happen. I can never thank them enough. That was from my, uh, my brother Bob, who was back in the States, but he was in Afghanistan. Um, later on, if anybody wants to see this pictures, there's a place on the base called Pete's Place. It's a lounge, bar, uh, Mrs. Gansey just informed me it's one of the few places that serve beer uh, in the Air Force or in the services. It's called Pete's Place and the sign has uh, firefighting gear on it, pool table, show movies there, the guys uh, relax there. Um, the commanding officer made a video and uh, we're going to watch it right now. Thank you. 
Kathleen and all members of the GSC family, I'm Blaine Holt, the current commander of the 376 Air Expeditionary Wing here at Manas in Dishtek, Kurdistan. I just wanted to take some time at this very special time and tell you how much Chief Gansey means to us in our hearts and that uh, every day we still recognize that uh, the sacrifice that the Chief made uh, was for his fellow man and we are as committed to the cause uh, here in this part of the country and stopping terrorism as we were uh, after the, the towers fell. Here at uh, Gansey, although we've now uh, change the name of the air base to the transit center at Manaz uh, in, in part with a lot of the uh, new initiatives that we're working with the government of Kyrgyzstan. Uh, I can tell you that uh, in the local area, uh, even Kyrgyz nationals that I meet walking on the street, if I ask them about the transit center at Manaz, they might not know what I'm talking about. But if I use the word fancy, they all know. You know, our uh, unit of prolific history goes back to World War II. And uh, we're very proud of the 376 that to be members of it uh, since we share uh, a lineage with so many heroes from, from the early days when we were flying the B-24 Liberator and our other nickname, the Liberandos. Uh, one of the things that you'll see here if you walk around the, uh, the base is uh, we, we refer to the Liberandos here as, or Manas as, uh, the home of Gansey's Liberandos. And it says it on our signs, and uh, as I talk to every new airman that arrives, I want them to know the linkage between 9-11, our mission here, and why we want to honor the memory of Chief Peter Gansey. Best wishes and God bless to all of you at home, and thank you for your continued support of all our airmen, soldiers, sailors, and marines. And uh, I wish you well. Thank you.